Hey guys, Drifter here. Today I've got a video for you about custom thumbsticks in gaming and why they matter. We're going to be talking about stick length, dome, convex, stickiness, and overall player choice and how it can help you aim better. The gameplay you're going to get to see is some really good blackout gameplay of me going ham in solo squads, well, after my teammate doesn't make it. And before we go any further, you should know that this video is sponsored by Scuff Gaming. I've been a Scuff sponsor since about 2010 or so, and for 2019 they wanted me to work on a series that goes over each feature feature that they have on the controller in depth, and today that is thumbsticks. So uh, this is my scuff controller right here. You can uh, see it bright and clear on the screen. It's a drifter scuff. It's linked down there below. And on this one, I have two thumbsticks of different lengths. I have a short thumbstick on the left and a significantly longer than average thumbstick on the right. The reason that I have these custom sticks is so that I can aim more accurately and move quicker. So on the right hand side, when it comes to aiming, because your hands have physical limits, there is only so small a so precise a movement you can make. And while people are very good at that and your hands are very good tools, they are limited. If you wanted to be able to make more precise movements on a stick, if you make a longer stick, you have to move it further to get the exact same angular deflection. Now, normally you would think, well, if I move it further, that means it's slower and it's bad. But the opposite is true for aiming. If you can make big movements that make subtle changes in your aim, that can make you more accurate or at least more comfortable with your aim which is why I use a longer stick on the right hand side but the opposite is true if for my walking around stick for the walking around stick shorter is better because I have to move less distance to hit all the way left right up down so that I can accelerate just that little millisecond or two faster than my enemies that little advantage and it's also a comfort factor because it allows me to treat my left stick like a d-pad and just all or nothing button it with very little in between while at the same time having a much more precise aiming stick. If you're going to be a competitive, sweaty, hardcore gamer, there are considerations to be made for domed versus convex sticks. Personally, I am a fan of these domed sticks right here. I like mine to be like little bubbles on top because when I hold my controller, if you guys can see it, when I aim, what I'm primarily doing is I'm pushing around with the bottom of my thumb. This is how I aim and move around. And in doing so and having a round top, it has less pressure on my hand and is therefore more comfortable. Now, other gamers are different. Other gamers put their thumbs on top and just push down and do a very sort of direct control. It's probably more accurate, to be honest with you. And those guys are going to greatly prefer these little convex sticks because they rest so very, very nicely against your thumb just like that. They're, they're just nice to have, and it's a matter of comfort, and it's a matter of how you play. And finally, of course, sometimes grip matters too. The good thing about the scuff sticks is that they have a very nice sticky texture to them. Don't think sticky as in like gross, wet, or like glue. Think sticky as in like just getting a good grip, like a pistol grip, like a military fiber sort of thing. And they also don't have those little dots. I have no idea why PlayStation and Xbox originally had these little dots on their thick sticks. I think it was to sort of get better grip, but they always dug into my fingers and they were uncomfortable. But the, uh, the little ridges on here, which you can see very closely. The little ridges on the scuff stick are much softer on my delicate gamer hands and more comfortable for me. But of course, if you don't like these, I'm going to go ahead and pop this off. You can just change them out anytime to literally anything you want very, very quickly, very effectively. And that's one of the things I like about the Vantage is that if I want to try a new configuration or if this configuration doesn't work for me, I'm doing this without looking at it really. There we go. I can just change it out exactly that fast with a little pack like this, which will come with your scuff. So then you'll probably want to ask me, well, how much better will I get if I do have longer sticks or shorter sticks or custom sticks? And the answer is, it depends on the person a little bit, but don't expect to just suddenly morph into formal or scump or be a godly pro player just because you have any sort of controller. Ultimately, customizing your controller or your gaming experience, and in this case, your thumbsticks, is about allowing you to have more control over your gaming experience. There's the default, but the default doesn't fit or is good for everybody. Having more choices, having things you can try, allows you to find the thing that you're most comfortable with. And if you're playing on a controller that you're more comfortable with, you will almost certainly perform better. And that's the reason that Scuff and all sorts of gaming keyboards and mice and things like that exist. They're primarily designed around giving players better choices for better comfort and better inputs. And that is it. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something useful about why Scuff has custom sticks. And if you're interested, of course, the link is down there below in the description and I'll see you next time. Drifter out.